The natural tendency of neighborhoods and of local governments and indeed state governments is to focus on the immediate problem, the house that is vacant next door, the structure that is burned out down the street. What I try to do is I work with local governments when I work with nonprofit community associations or when I work with state legislatures is to ask them to look beyond the immediacy of the problem and to begin to ask the question of what allows this problem to occur? What tools could you use that would allow you to both react to the immediate problem and stop the problem from occurring again tomorrow or next month or next year? So we're working across a wide range of communities. That which holds us together is how to convert vacant and abandoned property into a vibrant and productive place.